Hi guys, this is just a quick video covering some things you'll need to be aware of if you're following along with our 2D top down shooter series using Unity 6. We started making the videos using an older version of Unity, and a few minor things have changed since then. The main thing you need to be aware of is around the input system. A few years ago, Unity released a new input system as an optional package that you could install. This is now fully integrated in Unity 6, so we no longer need to install it. We also don't need to create a new input actions file, as there's now a default one created in the root of the assets folder. Unfortunately, the default input actions in this file are different than in older versions of Unity. We make use of the fire action in the series, but this is no longer in the default actions. We can work around this by right clicking on the attack action and renaming it to fire. Aside from that, there are a few things that Unity have renamed. For example, when adding a script, the menu now says mono behavior script rather than C sharp script. To help you out, we'll add notification cards to highlight what's changed. For new videos in the series, we'll be upgrading to Unity 6. For those that have already started with an older version of Unity, we'll now show you how to upgrade. We'll go to Unity Hub and install the latest version. On the projects list, we'll change the editor version to Unity 6. Then we'll open the project. When prompted, we'll select Change Version. We'll get a warning message, which we can accept by clicking Continue. It then tells us that some of our scripts need to be updated. We'll select yes for these and other files that might be found later. This will fix all our scripts. Next, it will prompt us to upgrade the materials. We'll press OK to do this. It will then warn us about deprecated packages. We'll click to open the package manager. Then we'll remove the Visual Studio Code Editor package as this is now deprecated. We can now close the package manager. Finally, we need to re import the TMP essentials. Now we can start the game and everything should work as it did before. Hopefully this will allow you to follow this series using the latest version of Unity. If you have any issues following along, let us know in the comments. If you want to be alerted when the next video in the series is out, then subscribe and click the bell icon. A big thank you to all our patrons, we really appreciate you helping to support the channel. If you'd like to help and also get access to the source code, you can find details in the description. Thanks guys!